Let's make a deal. Bitch, be for real. Is you off a pill? Okay. Let's make a deal. Rumpel still skin. She wanna see my purple pickle up in the wind. Okay. Sean Glenn, that's off, bitch. Get in. And if your nigga don't like me, hit any chin chin. Bitch, I'm hotter than a pepper, no mint. <sighs> Big stepper, no still. What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Clark Palo, aka YKP, whatever you're gonna call me, and I'm back with another banger YouTube video. Banger YouTube video, man, it's almost Christmas time. Came out with the ho 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 Santa, you know what I'm saying? I'm out here rocking around, fucking around, man. It is Clark Palo, bitch, I am back. Do you guys see the title? Do you see the thumbnail? Guess what we're doing, bro? Guess, do you, do you know what we're doing, bro? Do you want me to tell you? Man, today we're bringing back the sneaker collection video, bro. I've been getting bugged about this comment. Or this video in my comments for literally all year the thing is with me is i haven't really been picking up shoes but what i am going to be doing is doing this sneaker video so that you know what i'm saying within the next few months as i start picking up shoes i can do another one because i want y'all to be updated with what i have currently and it's not like i wasn't buying shoes i have some shoes that i copped this year but it's just nothing crazy you feel me but it is a good collection i, I don't want to i don't want to bore you guys bro i'm not going to be taking too long but it is almost christmas so if you guys you know what i'm saying are having a good holiday you know what i'm saying hit the like button if you're having a bad holiday i don't give a fuck hit the like button no i'm just kidding if you guys are having a good holiday comment down below why you're happy if you're sad bro let me know why and uh, let's get into today's video, man. Ah. Aren't you guys not like I said? Well, first off, I haven't even done I haven't done a room tour. I forgot that I still am yet to do a room tour. Like you guys have no idea. You have no idea the living situation here. You like that's the next video, literally. I like I, I forgot that I have not done this for you guys yet. Um, but yeah, you guys can partially see like the boxes up there, but I don't think you can see any of my shoes. That's respectable. But um, let me put this chain on real quick. Get some drip for the video. I apologize. You know what I'm saying? Your bitch is getting wet while she's watching this with you. I didn't mean to do all that. I apologize. Like, you know what I'm saying? Tell your grandma she can calm down. It's okay. She ain't got to get all riled up. You know what I'm saying? Just some, woo, you know what I'm saying? Something light. I got to get my chain fixed because my shit broke. This isn't my full chain. This is just a piece of it. But it's like I could damn near turn this into a bracelet. Look at that. Another bracelet, but anyway, what I am gonna start off with, bro, is um, the shoes that are on my feet. And what do I have on my feet right now? Some black kitty cats, bro. Some black pussies on my feet, bro. Do you see these? Look at how, ooh, look at how crispy. Do you see that? Congratulations. Look at that, man. Niggas in Paris, bro. You don't even know. The fuck? What are you supposed to do with a shoe like this when you get it for 140 bucks, 240 bucks, and now it's worth like a band, bro? And all these niggas be tripping over the shoe, and you don't care. You know what you do? You wear them bitches every time you go out. So that's what I do with my black cats. And look at how nice they look, bro. Look at that. I could. You can smell the new shoe. You can smell the Tucson, Arizona. The Scottsdale, Arizona, where I got them from, bro. Can you believe that? And they don't even stink on the inside. Y'all niggas smell that? Bro, I'm telling you, this great shoe great pickup so happy i got this shoe um hopefully i'm like a super editor i put the price up from StockX or something like that so you guys can see that um you know what i'm saying that i don't know i got these shoes for 200 bucks so you know what i'm saying they were like like 800 now that's i don't really know what else to say you know what i'm saying you can wear the black cats with a bunch of fits it's like a million outfits you can go out there with i'm not gonna do all that today i'm sorry i'm not gonna bore you this is a shoe video anyway back to the video look at these fours before I get into the next pair of shoes. Um, this is just on some real shit. I have these in my closet. They're like a child size. If any of my niggas out there in the world, hey, I'm not hating. You got a kid, need some shoes? Hit me up. I will I will, I will, will mail you these shoes and you can give them to your kid for Christmas I'm, or after. I don't care. I will pay for the shipping. Just hit me and show me your child's fucking sh other shoe sizes so I know that they're a fucking uh, 13C. You know what I'm saying? 13 fucking children. Damn. That's so small. But anyway, back to the video, man. Bam, man. Look at that. You never seen these before. You never seen these before. You never. Bro, let me see. Let me show you guys. Hopefully, my fucking thing will focus. Look at that. I don't even wear these forces like that anymore. I've had these for a minute, though. Damn, they got. I'm saying I don't wear them. Look at they got hella crease right there. I never even realized that. I never step out in these anymore. Um. Damn, they got fucked up right there. They see these? I wore these to a to a to a uh, Indian party. My niggas, we was getting turned, bro. And dancing to all the Indian music, and that's from hitting the big toe step that they got out there in India. So I would just that's that's just a I should have showed the other shoe. You wouldn't have seen that. But these, 
I got from my bro, Craze Customs, bro. I'll put his Instagram up. Bro's fucking phenomenal. I always say that every time I show these shoes, I need to get some more. Um, he's really hard. Look at the detail, bro. He hand paints everything. He does a bunch of other different stuff, too. He, like, this is... This shows quality, you know what I'm saying, with the the strokes and stuff like that. But I'm telling you, his the potential he has is crazy. I just like these because these are so subtle. And you're not really doing too much when you put these on, you feel me? And you can step out in some nice forces. And niggas be like, how the fuck did you get those? And it's like, bitch, don't worry about it. You know what I'm saying? Like, just keep it moving. Look at them. You know what I'm saying? Why as I walk by you, nigga, with my purple Nike sign? Like, you know what I'm saying? But, like, you feel me? Go get some shoes, bro. I got these for, like... Of course, he's not going to plug you like this, but I I paid basically how much it costs to get Air Forces. They were like 80 bucks for the Forces, and then I paid 20 more for the for the custom. So, bro, 100 bucks. You probably spending 120 bucks, 130 bucks, bro, to get you some nice-ass Forces, bro. So, you do that, bro. Next pair of shoes. All right, you guys. So the, damn, why am I making it so dark? Damn. Or so light. I'm over here clicking buttons. I don't know what that shit did. These, I'll put the video up, hopefully. Uh, these are from all my first videos, bro. I can't believe I bought these back in the day because they didn't fit me. But um, these are some Air Forces, bro. I don't really wear them like that no more. They just kind of sit in my closet, but they're hard. They are hard. If you guys see any shoes, I wear size 9.5 to 11, bro. Like, some of these shoes will be varying sizes. If you guys see any shoes that you guys fuck with deep, y'all hit me on Instagram, bro, and tell me why you think you deserve them. And I'll try my best to get one of my shoes out to y'all. I just have to I have to have them because like, I don't want to just sit here and talk about how I don't wear my stuff. And then, you know what I'm saying, there could be a kid who was once like how I was who didn't have none. So, I'm just sitting here talking all that shit. And I don't want to be a bitch-ass nigga. So, instead of me being a bitch-ass nigga, you bitch-ass niggas, go follow my Instagram and DM me why you deserve one of these shoes that I'm showing. Okay? Doesn't that sound good? Doesn't that sound fun? Instead of me just showing you shoes? Exactly. But yeah, man, I fuck with these because they got like some snake skin going on. I don't know, bro. You, Everyone had the brown ones. The brown air forces and i was like bro i need to step out in them hoes because niggas will get clomped on you know what i'm saying and then when i found these at the fucking outlet bro i was like what what they're brown nigga, only nigga in town like you have never seen these bro i swear to gosh you've never seen these but yeah man these are my brown air forces i don't really know what they're called i just call them my snake skins but um yeah man hopefully you guys enjoyed those shoes like i said about the other comment make sure you guys go do that and let's get the next pair of shoes that was a gay ass transition. Let's do this one instead. Next, next pair of shoes. Whoop! Oh, you thought I was going to show these. <laughs> Nigga, what? You thought I was going to show these? I'm not showing these busted ass beats. For real, I'm going to show you guys these, man. Wow. Isn't it crazy where we got in fucking dressing in today's society, bro? Like, how do you. There's so many variants of. of shoes that you can wear. Like, I have the black cats on right now. Three different variants of all black bust downs that you could fucking tear shit up within a nightclub. You know what I'm saying? Isn't that crazy? But realistically, bro, I got these Balenciagas, these fucking sock runners or fucking fucking Instagram bitch shoes. Like, I can't stand these shoes anymore, bro. I literally hate these shoes. I'll probably wear them tonight instead of these fours because they're more comfy. But uh, fuck Balenciaga, fuck Balenciaga, and fuck Balenciaga. So, fuck Balenciaga. That's why I don't want these anymore. Um, if you wear Balenciaga, fuck you, because um, everyone saw what the fuck they just did. Don't really have to speak on it. Now, not if they wear, this is me 100% being hypocritical. Fuck you if you wear Balenciaga, but I'm going to wear these tonight if I want to. Bitch ass nigga, so don't, but just no, fuck Balenciaga. It's, it's like, I'm selling these, so it's like, when these are off, they're done. Like, fuck Balenciaga. You know what I'm saying? Until future tell me that it's okay to wear Balenciaga again or something like that. Or Chief Keith. You know what I'm saying? Now I might be like, all right. You know I'm saying? But right now, fuck, fuck them niggas. Or Kanye. Maybe Kanye wearing me. But, but for right now, fuck them. They weird, right? We can all agree. But not these. What do you guys rate these out of 10, bro? Honestly, for a long portion of my time of having these shoes, these were some of my favorite shoes in my collection. Only because the the concept of the shoe is just so dope how it's kind of like the sock look and then it's also um a sporty look i just liked it because you could wear these and move around you know what i'm saying if you go to the bay area you're walking around the pier or something like that you don't want to just sit there and fucking walk in jordan fours i can't stand a nigga who walks like they have a stick up their ass because they're wearing some fucking beat ass fucking fours or some fucking shoes and some jordans and they're not comfortable you feel me that's why i like to wear yeezys and fucking slides and then some buzz down balenci's you know what i'm saying because you could just be comfy walk around you're not worried about look at this you're not worried about that shit creasing you don't get a fuck. I don't give a fuck. You give a fuck. So that's why I love these shoes, or I did love these shoes. But then Balenciaga uh, owned up to being pedophile. So no more. But if you guys enjoy these shoes, let me know, and let's get into the next one. Bam! I got these Jordan Fives next, bro. Look at these, man. Now look. I want to point out the fact mid video, bro. 
This is Clark from like like almost a week later. It's like January 3rd right now or 2nd or something like that. Damn, it's already January 3rd. It was just New Year's. You see how fucking fast time goes by, bro? But anyway, hey man, I got these Jordan 5s. I don't know what to call these. I don't know what the fuck these are called. I just know that they're nice and I got them for the low. And I really fuck with these. I really fuck with 5s. 5s used to be my favorite Jordans. So, so far, my favorite Jordans ever, my first favorites ever was Jordan 12s. The Taxi 12s were my favorite and the Cherry Red fucking 12s were my favorite. Then the 5s became my favorite and now my favorite are the 4s. But these fives are sick you guys you guys can see them right there, man Nothing too much to say about them. They're just some fives, you know I don't even know what if you guys know what these are called Let me know um, in the comments down below. I could probably take better pictures with these but I really really fuck with these fives man and Honestly, bro, I don't know how much of this left. I'm gonna edit for y'all because oh shit. What's that? Park a freak. What the fuck is that? Um, yeah, I don't know how much of this I'm gonna edit for you guys because realistically it's like I'm just showing y'all my shoes So the next pair of shoes I want to show you guys is actually my playboy air force ones I don't know if I showed you guys these already because I, I looked at the film right now And I don't believe I did but I don't I know I showed air forces Um, but yeah, man here my air for my, my playboy air force ones. These are sick to me, bro I got these made um custom by Lil Bro from a high school near my house, actually. If I'm if I'm remembering correctly, Lil Bro's the one who made it. He pulled up on me and he, he threw me these shoes, bro. So shout out, bro. Uh, I hope he's still doing his thing when it comes to designs and customs and stuff. Because if not, he just bought me a pair of shoes, basically. But uh, yeah, I never really get to wear these, but these are hard as freaking hell. Um, yeah, man, what do you guys rate? Each shoe you guys like of mine, rate them down below. I give these at least a 7 out of 10, 8 out of 10, bro. These are sick to me. It's just they're kind of simple. But not a lot of people do the Playboy pink, in my opinion. I don't know. Maybe Maybe, maybe I'm just tripping, but I feel like a lot of the uh, the Burberry or like the the Louis and shit. I don't want to do all that. I wear Playboy, so I was like, bro, I can I can make it subtle. It's, it's 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 drip for sure, man. Let me know what you guys think. I know I showed you guys my Balenciagas. The next pair of shoes I'll show you guys will be a pair of fours because uh, we really don't have a lot of shoes left. I just have like two more after this. But this one is ah, look at that man. Look at that man. We got the Jordan Four. What are these even called? The these I was gonna say Motorsport Fours, but they're not Purple Metallic Fours. I believe that's what they're called. But look at that. That dude, look at the purple metallics, bro. Aren't those sexy as hell? Just look at that. Damn, damn. Now, the thing is, is, I probably could clean some of my shoes. Like, you can see it get dirty right there a little bit. That's just because I'm not the nigga that's sitting here cleaning my shoes every 10 seconds. I'm not the, you know, that's just not what I'm doing anymore. Um, I definitely give these shoes a 9 out of 10. These shoes are fucking dope as hell. I don't like to wear them that much because they're crystal white. But I got them in the collection, man. And I don't know if I'll ever really bust them out. But maybe my kids will see them one day, bro. I don't know. I, don't, I never really wear them. But yeah, I, I easily give these an 8 out of 10, 9 out of 10. Like, real shit. These are hard as hell. Like, I don't I don't really know what else to say about them. If they had some black and purple ones, like the black metallic fours, like, that would be hard. Black purple metallic fours that would be hard but you guys probably already seen them when i pulled them out i wasn't going to show you guys these but these are the topaz fours now a lot of people say i choke my shit up but I, I i could give a fuck bro um i got these recently i was gonna get them for the low but i low-key paid the high but i mean i guess they're still going up right now they are worth a little bit of money i think these are damn near the best fours ever these are some of the best four ever i used to kick it with this bitch ass nigga who uh who also had these and he, i had been wanting these for a long time um but he was the first nigga i actually seen with them on feet so i took them from him and i put them on and i was like damn bro these are hard like I fuck with them and then I just chose to go get my own I could have took them but I just chose to go get my own um but yeah I'm, and I'm only saying that because hopefully this video gets shown to bro so he could come say what's up to me again. But anyway, man, these shoes, the Topaz 4s or whatever they are, they're hard as hell in my opinion, bro. Like, I look at the bottom, bro. Look at the... Woo! Is that doo-doo stains, bro? And I just like how it gets all cracked in the front if you look at the toe box. It gets all cracked. I don't know, it just gives it so much character, bro. These are sick. Tell me these are not sick, bro. These are like a 10 out of 10. Easy any day. These are so hard to me, bro. I don't know what it is about these, man. These topaz fours, bro. And then the last two pairs of shoes, bro, is another pair of fours. Here, we'll do a we'll do a coin. If it's one, I mean if it's heads, we'll do the four. If it's tails, we'll do the ten. Heads or tails, Siri. Oh, Siri, flip a coin. She said it's heads. I don't remember which one heads is. I think it's the four, so we'll show the fours. Hey, man, I'm over here showing my whole body. Y'all can see Clark is not fat anymore, 100%. And this is me after, so this is post-surgery, bro. Like, I'm, I'm supposed to be feeling, getting, gaining weight. Clark is over here looking good. Woo! Thunder fours or lightning fours, whatever the frick these are called. You just probably have never seen them in person. I got them. Gotcha, bitch. Probably, like, like top three hardest Jordans ever. Like, what the fuck? Like, how did you even get these, Clark? I guess how much I got them for. I got them for $200. Nigga, that's why they're so hard to me. These are like seven, eight hundred dollars now, bro. I got them for two hundred, and I don't even fuck with that nigga anymore. He's, um, but yeah, man, I don't really know what to say about these Thunder Fours. I came up like these are ancient shoes, and they're in great condition, nine out of ten condition at least. Um, 
yeah, man, I don't really know what else to say. These are just, these are absolutely gorgeous in my opinion. Like, I, these are damn near one of my favorite shoes of all time ever. Like, and I don't even wear them like that. They're just, I just appreciate, I'm a, I'm a nigga who appreciates, I appreciate shit. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna look at that motherfucker and be like, that's whore. But, um, hey man, if you made it this far along in the video, I just wanna ask you guys, would you guys like to see me react to videos more? Would you like, like, the Andrew Tate situation that just went down or like anything? Like, would you like me to react to stuff? If so, let me know by commenting down below. Bro, do I have an Adam's apple? What the fuck? Nigga, do I have an... All right, man. Last pair of shoes, bro. You know what I'm saying? We got my Tory Burches. TBs for all the women. You know what I'm saying? The Tory Burches. These are like some designers y'all don't even know about, man. You know what I'm saying? The TBs. The tuberculosis. I don't even know what to call them, man. Some simple, simple all whites. And then the realistically last thing we got is the fucking Timberland. Do you see the size of that fucking thing? Nigga want to kick me in my back. Boom. Ah! Why did I even do that? Anyway, bro, fucking Timberlands, bro. Like, you can stomp a nigga head and I could go. I'm just waiting for the day I go to the East Coast because I've never been to the East Coast. But when I do, bro, these are these are coming out. I've only worn these one time. They still sm <sighs> That new Timberland smell is a smell that you'll never... It just gave me chills. Look, that's a smell you'll never forget. I need y'all to really see my chills, though. Y'all see that? Shit's crazy, bro. But yeah, Timberlands, man. I don't really know what else to say, bro. These are hard as hell, bro. Like, I don't wear them like that, but when I do, I feel like I'm stepping correctly. You know what I'm saying? And I really could put someone's face into the ground with these. But... With that being said, man, let me know what you guys rated my shoe collection out of 10. Let me know what your favorite shoes from my shoe collection was. And also let me know what your favorite shoe in your shoe collection is. If you don't have a favorite yet, let me know what your favorite would be in the one that you want to get. Like your holy grail. Hey, man, if you guys enjoyed today's video, let me know by leaving a like, commenting down below, hitting the subscribe button. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see all of your beautiful faces in the next video, man. But please, just comment down something. Just comment something. I'm not going to tell you what to comment. Just talk to you. I just want to talk. I just want to say what's up. Like y'all can say whatever, bro. It could be about how your day was. How asking my how my day was anything you could think of bro tell me about how your new year's was tell me about how your christmas was anything like that bro tell me your dreams and aspirations but i just want to hear i just want to talk to my niggas you feel me so hey man without any further ado bro i'll catch you guys later thank you guys again peace